Hey there, this is my video for the installation of the Journey Tech EP001K passive pickup system. First thing that you do is you take the strings off of your guitar, follow that up by removing the strap button. Using a stepped drill bit, I drilled out the the hole for a uh, about a half inch. Go carefully, you know, don't go too hard. You don't want to tear anything out. And take your time. Once I got it to the right size, I was able to use a twist bit to finish drilling the hole out all the way. And here I've got the cardboard template with the golf tee and a little bit of the sticky stuff in place using some Gorilla Glue gel glue to glue the pickup actually into place on the uh, the soundboard. I do have kind of big hands and big wrists so it is a little bit of a trick for me to get in there and get it all the way in. I'm folding off the corner just to uh, to help it fit around the bracing. Last double check just to make sure that I'm going to be able to get this in the right spot once I put it in. And quickly I'm going to drop it. Give myself a little bit of a panic. Luckily I didn't get glue on anything. Not that the guitar is a pristine looking thing. I'm using that toothpick to help get it positioned before I fully push it into place and glue it in. Repeat that two more times and you basically got it done. Here they are installed. The middle one slid a little further back on me than I would have liked, but I, you know, ultimately I think it's going to be okay. Here I've got a coat hanger with the end just kind of bent off and I'm sticking that into the uh, into the pickup jack. So I can pull it through the hole because I can't get my arm to reach all the way. I did wind up having to do this a couple of times just to get the uh, the end pin length correct so that when it was all bolted together, the uh, the threaded end was was flush. You see, it's just a little short there. Now this time I've got a little more of the thread sticking out and I'm using that coat hanger to hold the uh, the end pin in place. Just tighten it up with a little crescent wrench. Feel it finally starting to get tight there. And I can take that little strap button piece and thread that on. You don't want that sticking with the threads coming through that and you don't want the threads to be re recessed. You just want it to be kind of flush. Once that's there, I just got it with a pair of pliers. And again, this is not a pristine guitar. You know, if this was your your high-end Martin, you'd want to put a little bit of tape around the end while you're doing that so you didn't scratch it. But this is my beater guitar. And yeah, at some point I'm going to manage getting a uh, getting a demo done. Thanks for watching.